So here we are in DaVinci Resolve. We're going to learn how to set up a timeline ready to import to TikTok. We need to go over to the edit page down here along the bottom. Open up the media pool, right click, timelines, create new timeline. Now here we have the name of it. I'm just going to call it TT for TikTok. I'm going to untick this project settings and then go to, across to format. This is DaVinci Resolve 17, by the way, the uh, free version. And then this resolution here, we need to swap this around. So we need to put the 1080 in this square and the 1920 in the other square. 1080. 19, 20, and then hit create. Change your frame rate if you want to. Most of mine's in 60 FPS, so I'll put that at 60. And then hit create timeline. And here we go. There's your timeline. Perfect shape for a mobile phone. And then you can just import your clip. I've got a clip here. I'm just going to drag it in to show you what I mean real quick. Import your clip onto your timeline. Into your media pool and onto your timeline. And there we have it ladies and gentlemen TikTok shaped video once it's in there you can highlight the clip the video clip go up here to transform that's where you get your zooms also if you can't see the settings uh, for zooms and stuff once you've highlighted the clip just click inspector up here in the top right hand side I've got to say that before the only thing left to do is once you've got your footage how you want it and set your zooms and done all your text and all your editing and cutting and whatnot is just uh, hit the render tab go up here i've turned my camera off so you can see these bits here give it a file name drop it in a location swap it from quicktime to mp4 make sure these settings here are the same that we did in step one so we needed 1080 by 1920 not 1920 by 1080 hit render it will replace mine so i've already done this a few times but yours will just render and there we are ladies and gentlemen perfect size video rendering for TikTok uploads, YouTube shorts, Instagram reels, all them stories on Facebook. Next video we'll do the move to camera overlay and we'll figure that out as well for you guys. Much love. If this was helpful, don't forget to like, comment, share, follow, subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers guys.